Today we're going to use a program called Audacity. It is a program that is free and that you can edit sound in. So click Start All Programs. It's spelled A-U-D-A-C-I-T-Y. It has a pair of headphones and lightning in between it. Click that. These are the tools that you use. This is called the I-Beam. It's the basic this is where your cursor is. This is called the envelope tool where you can make things go louder and quieter. And then this is called the time shift where you can move the whole audio clip to another location. This is um, backspace, rewind, play, record, pause, stop, and fast forward. So we're going to click project, import audio. You're going to navigate by clicking My Computer. Go to the Assignment folder. Go to Ryan's Classes. And there is a folder in there that says Audacity Music. You're just going to click on one of those sounds. And there is actually folders in here that have multiple versions of each of these songs. It doesn't matter to me which song you pick. It's about, we're just going to play with them and edit them. We're not going to save these. We're not going to ever use them again. So I'm going to just click a song. And when I click play, I should be able to hear this song. When I click stop, that means I can edit the song. I can only edit music when it's stopped. Just like most things, we're going to highlight what we want to change. We can go up to effects and we can change things. If I want to make it the song faster, I can tell it to go 20% faster. If I want to make the song at a different pitch, either deeper or higher, I can tell it to do that. Those are all under effect, and we'll just play around with that. And then you'll play that and listen to it and see how you like it. When you save this, you'll save the project in your folder, but you can't use the project anywhere. That is just for editing. When you're done editing, you're going to export it as an MP3, and that will be the subject of the next video. Thank you.